Good morning, my name is Matthew from Axel and today I'm making a short video to show how to set up a terminal to run with a webcam and specifically Skype. Webcams do present a specific problem in that they generate a lot of traffic which can't be controlled as you can't easily control the frame rate or the resolution. So ironically, lower quality webcams provide better performance normally as they work at lower resolutions and lower frame rates. Right, so to set the terminal up, I'll run through the quick setup. Keyboard English, terminal name I'll leave as is. Resolution I'll leave as is. DHCP enabled. I'm connecting to an RTP server. I can enter the name or the IP address here. So that's terminal setup. To set up the USB redirection, we go back into the setup via advanced. The first step is to enable the Remote FX USB redirection for the webcam and to do that we go into Terminal Global RDP ICA the legible devices. I already have the webcam connected. If we go down the bottom here you can see the webcam and the headset. Now the, the, the specific point is I'm going to use Remote FX redirection for the webcam and use the legacy redirection for the audio for the headset. And that provides two separate channels, one for the video and one for the audio, and that seems to give a better performance. So to enable the remote FX redirection for the webcam, select it, we see it pop up here, and we save and save. Then we go into sessions, session one, and down the bottom here we have redirected resources. So the first step is to enable remote FX redirection down here, set that to yes. So that will enable the webcam for this particular session. And then up here where we have audio, I will enable that for play and record, I speakers and microphone. That means that we're using the legacy method for the audio and the remote FX method for the video. Quit out. So we log in fire up Skype. While that's firing up I'll just show two things. If you press con Control Alt Shift I a window pops up and down here we can see USB port redirection is in use which is the webcam and up here we have the redirected audio and that shows which codec is being used so looking at that we can see that the terminal has reported that it has these two peripherals connected and it has requested that they be accessed through different means. The other thing I'll show, if you go into the control panel, devices and printers, then you see the remote FX devices, i.e. the webcam, are here, but the things which are redirected through the legacy method, i.e. the audio device, you don't see in the control panel. If we were to redirect the audio through remote FX, then we would see the Logitech microphone in here as well. Okay, well this is rather a strange experiment, Skyping yourself. Uh, it, it feels a bit strange because you can see and hear both ends of the conversation at the same time. But just to, to prove the whole thing working, I'll initiate the call from the Apple. I'll pick up here. And there we have the Skype connection. Um, I know you can't hear the audio, the audio is, is working. That sounds even stranger because you're hearing both the sent and the received uh, audio at the same time. But um, everything does work. Uh, so I hope you found that interesting. And if you have any questions, then please contact your local Axel office. Thank you very much and bye for now.